This is Samantha Narson with your News in 90 for Wednesday, September 23rd. Here are your stories. Food banks struggled to keep up with high demand during the pandemic. The number of people in the United States who rely on food banks to feed their families increased. The Campaign Against Hunger is an organization in New York that has been around for 21 years. Back in April, it provided 250,000 meals a week. Now, it provides 315,000 meals a week. Since COVID-19 hit, it opened a warehouse and 250 different partner sites. However, it cannot afford the space it now needs. The Better Business Bureau reports scammers are using the pandemic to target college students. The organization received reports from students. The scams begin with an email sent to students' official school email address. The scammer impersonates a professor or university department, offering the student a job. If they accept, the student is asked for more personal and financial information. The Bureau advises students to research any company offering them work before applying. Former New York City Mayor Michael Bloomberg will contribute his financial resources in the upcoming election. He's raised over $16 million so far. The money will erase the debt of over 30,000 previously incarcerated individuals. Bloomberg committed at least $100 million to help his former opponent, presidential nominee Joe Biden, win Florida. That's your News in 90. I'm Samantha Narson, but your Florida news when you need it is always on at wuft.org.